are quite openly Jewish. This is a pro-Palestinian march. Right. I'm not accusing you of anything, but I'm worried about the reaction to your presence. So you can escort it out of this area so you can go about your business, go where you want freely, or if you choose to remain here, because you are for the breach of these two other people, I share the shock and the anger that many are feeling when they saw the clips um, over the weekend. And, you know, what I would say about Mark Rowley and the police, they do have a, a difficult job. Of course, I appreciate that. But what happened was clearly wrong. And it's right that they've apologised for that. And yes, I do have confidence in him, but that's on the basis that he works to rebuild the confidence and trust of not just the Jewish community, but the wider public, particularly people in London, but more broadly. And you regain that trust and, their, and that confidence by making it clear that the police are not tolerating behaviour that we would all collectively deem unacceptable when we see it, because it undermines our values. Uh, and I think that is critical. And I know the Home Secretary uh, will be meeting the Commissioner later today. I know, I heard I you. Want, I don't want to stay here, I want to leave. Well, in that case, sir, I'm going that way. when the crowd is gone, I will help you escort you out. I'm going to walk. No, sir. I don't want anybody antagonising anything.